Hi traders, in this video, I am going to explain about high frequency trading, HFT in short form. So what is high frequency trading and how does it work? What is co-location, tick data and the strategies, etc. Uh, for HFT, we can call it as a special class of algorithmic uh, trading. And regarding algorithmic trading, I had explained in my previous video in brief already. So uh, let's move on to this HFT now. The computers or servers makes decision to initiate orders based on information received electronically before the human traders are capable of uh, processing the information in the fraction of microseconds or nanoseconds. The HFT captures small profit per share uh, on every trade and it continues um, taking a short term position several times in a, each day. Generally, high frequency trading characterized by its high speed, high turnover rates and high order to trade ratios that leverages high frequency financial data by using highly sophisticated algorithms. The HFT has potential sharp ratio, thousands of times higher than a traditional uh, buy and uh, hold strategies. As per the economic times in India, HFT trading is increasing to the one third of total volume traded and it is a good growth every year. Now we will get a big question in the mind. How does uh, this much high frequency and speed is possible? The answer with this is uh, the only co-location and a sophisticated algorithms which we are using. I will give you a very simple explanation with a simple diagram. Let us say here it is a NSE uh, stock exchange. Okay, the NAC it provides a co-location facility very near to the exchange um, in the form of rack spaces or something and it is uh, committed uh, connected to the exchange with a high speed optical fiber cables. A HFT trader keeps his uh, server system and a setup in a co-location and uh, this HFT trader again connects his server or ATS algorithmic trading system to a server system in the nearest data center and the control and access to this ATS is through internet that's how uh, this works let's say uh, algorithms running in a servers will uh, trade instead of a trader as per the given instructions of an algorithm as per the algo it works so that's how it is trading instead of uh, a human which replace here uh, you will be like uh, getting a doubt the server is connected uh, so close uh, with an optical cable directly to the exchange the server will receive a tick data from exchange which has more information than normal trader is getting through the internet like uh, uh, let's say bid price ask price available bid volume available ask volume and last traded price last traded size implied volatility etc as the data is uh, more accurate and fast it will catch more market opportunity you may uh, get a question like how does it helps for a hft trader uh, further uh, let me give you one small example with a simple example let's assume rbi has announced some news like some news uh, of interest rates which is related to news of some banks which leads to raise or fall of a banking sector or a banking stocks these algorithms of automated news analysis catches the news fastly and reacts accordingly. 
and sends sends the orders related to the banking stocks very fastly before a normal individual trader or observer can make that and uh, it makes a huge money algo so uh, let's discuss some of the high frequency trading strategies uh, like automated liquidity provision it is also called as a market making strategy it involves buying and selling securities to provide two side market on exchanges like high frequency market makers place of bid orders or offers buy or sell with a limit or sell orders mm, or uh, will get the direct profit from resulting with a bid or ask spreads the holding period of this strategy will be uh, like less than 1 minute next uh, we can call a market uh, micro structure trading or trading the tape strategy these high frequency machines analyze the flow of observed quotes in the order to extract prices information and it reverse engineers the trading party order flow and predicts likely future volumes of uh, buy and sell uh, thereby it anticipates the price movement trends uh, the holding period of this strategy will be like up to 10 minutes next to move on to event arbitrage the events this is uh, such as a company announcements of some earnings economic figures financial results based on these events also uh, it captures the opportunity and generate some short term profits the holding period for this would be 30 minutes to 1 hour mm, next uh, statistical trading the trading strategies which based on statistical uh, relationships among liquid securities across different markets which includes equities futures uh, foreign exchanges like let's say in simple words it can be like uh, correlation with other securities with a price differences the holding position period for this would be like it may last a day next like index arbitrage the buying and selling large volumes of with respect to changing in weights in the indices is called uh, as an index arbitrage the holding period may be a day or more and next a news based uh, trading as we already uh, as i took the example of rbi uh, news uh, it's an automated system based on some company sector or some government news or announcements and it takes a trade accordingly the holding position may be like it lasts for 30 minutes to 1 hour these are some of the uh, examples of high frequency trading strategies or some categories of high frequency trading the big players of hft in india like currently uh, examples are like investment bankers hedge funds and institutional clients you if you feel this video is uh, informative you like this video and comment your feedback or queries and subscribe to my youtube channel for more videos related to to stock markets and trends thank you